it's been a nightmare going to work, worrying who's going to be breaking in your house, your neighbor's house. You're just scared, you know. We're trying to protect our property and ourselves. They can't catch you with anything. They don't know what to do. They destroy it. I don't know if it's me or it's the neighborhood. I don't see anything in the neighborhood. When we get an outcry of complaints for an area, we analyze what's been going on in the area, crime trends, and then we will deploy the peacemakers into the area so that the bad guys know, hey, we're watching you. I love it. You know, I don't mind. The talk is there because of me. Yeah. I mean, you have people complaining that they don't want that on this block, and so I think that's a red flag, and I think the police should focus on those people. Why won't they want that on their block? They say that I run a prostitution. I run a motel. Simple as that. that. We've had an outcry of support from the community. And the people who seem to have a problem with it tend to be people committing crimes. Oh, they put that there to intimidate the customers. You know, people don't want to go in Canada. I wish there was another one right here. These trucks are capable of conducting surveillance 24 hours a day, seven days a week. I have an empty lot right here they can use. <laughs> you know what? I don't have anything different than any other motel here. The only thing that I don't have is the five stars. It's the only thing that I don't have. I think we're making progress and we're, we're not finished. We're going to continue to do what we have to do. I don't know what they even talking about. Neighbors complain. That they complain about what? There, there are no mistakes about it. Th this vehicle has it written all over it that it's conducting surveillance. We want people to know that we're watching the bad guys. But we're, we're gonna, we, we got them. We got them.